Welcome everyone and thank you so much for joining in this very very important update here on price action of Bitcoin. As we can see guys Fed cutting the rate by quarter point has definitely pushed the entire market. I mean the entire market has turned bullish and it has also pushed the price of Bitcoin to make another new all time high. So how high will the price go? What to expect in the media short term and even for the upcoming days. So today we are going to dive into all of the scenarios which are unfolding for Bitcoin. So before I do that. I want you guys to do me a favor and quickly destroy that like button. And to those individuals watching this for the first time to hit that subscribe button. Thank you very much. Now, what I want you guys to look at is this Wyckoff's price cycle. Because according to this bigger time frame, according to this Wyckoff's price cycle, the price of Bitcoin might have just started with this actual mark of face because around this area the demand is greater than supply yes guys breaking the previous high flipping that into support along with this white cups price cycle is definitely pointing us that we might have just entered this new mark of face which could turn the price of bitcoin very very bullish for the upcoming days upcoming month because we know according to this white cup price cycle before the cycle ends right before the cycle ends first we are going to form a distribution area like this overbought area and only after that we are expecting an actual continuation or a markdown phase to follow but until then until the price starts forming a new distribution area overbought area you can see until then we have a lot of room to grow because beside this wiker price cycle we are also aware that according to this livermore people the point theory here in a weekly time frame the price has already broken out of previous high and just like as shown here in an example price breaking the previous high flipping that into support is going to give us a new buying opportunity which it did i mean after breaking the previous high you can see the price of bitcoin has turned very very bullish following this lever more people point theory which is also pointing us a move here to the upside because we are aware guys right now beside this wyckoff's price cycle beside this jesse lever most people point theory even this descending channel or a bull flag scenario is playing out perfectly i mean the price of bitcoin has already overcome some of the most important resistance line and this resistance line rejected us in the past price action but if you look at it carefully you can see the same trend line got retested which acted as support and now it is resulting in a bullish move and according to this bull flag according to this continuation pattern you can see 90 200,000 is the area where we might be getting attracted for the upcoming days, upcoming weeks, and even for the upcoming month. Yes, you heard that correctly, guys. According to this pull flag, according to this decent channel breakout, 90 to 100,000 could be attracting us. And parallelly, price breaking out of this descending channel bull flag means we are also breaking out from this descending broad wedge, which is another bullish continuation pattern for bitcoin so according to this bullish continuation pattern if the price in the media short term starts showing weakness after breaking out of this upper trend line please please be aware that might be just a temporary pullback before expecting another continuation like this i mean in a bigger picture the price of bitcoin has started to turn very very bullish with the price objective up to 90 to 100 000. yes guys according to this descending broadening wedge as well if the price starts breaking here to the upside you can see in between 90 to 100 000 is where we could be getting attracted because we are aware guys right now the reason why we are expecting the price of bitcoin to continue higher is because this u as DT dominance is breaking out. I mean, breaking out, but to the downside. And this trend line has already confirmed this bearish move. I mean, this USDT was clearly following this rising channel or ascending channel. The lower trend line was acting as support, but if you look at this support, it has been broken. And now the same support also rejected us. So that means the USDT dominance is clearly breaking to the downside which could be pushing the price of bitcoin higher yes guys usdt dominance breaking downside means the price of bitcoin for the coming days could be favoring the longs because we are aware this usdt dominance is breaking down and in a bigger picture the price of bitcoin is turning bullish but in the media short term i also want you guys to look at this smaller picture i mean in a smaller picture according to our leading indicator you can see for the month of november the price has already touched the first price objective 
which was around 76,400. And now, if this here is going to result in a support, I mean, this trend line, which acted as resistance, if it turn out into support, then you can see it is going to trigger another bullish continuation pattern for Bitcoin. Yes, guys, even in the smaller time frame, price remaining above this monthly error line could be resulting in another continuation. And according to this leading indicator, you can see the next price already sits around 82,300. Yes, guys, 82,300 will be looked as our next price already if the price in the media short term manages to remain above this monthly error line. But what if this fails? I mean, what if the price fails to find support over this monthly error line? What in that case? In that case, I will be monitoring this price move as a retest. Bitcoin showing some exhaustion, liquidating the overall average longs, come back to this support in between 70,000, 72,000, the 0.5, 0.6, 100 Fibonacci line, and only after that, continue with this actual bullish move. Because I just showed you with this example, if the price in a bigger picture starts showing weakness, please be careful. That might be just a retest from the previous high and slowly start with another bullish continuation and if you look at it right now even according to this leading indicator this pullback will be just a temporary pullback to liquidate the over leverage longs and only after they start with an actual bullish continuation so you can see looking into different time frame looking into different scenarios price showing weakness will be looked as a temporary weakness and not a reversal like this i mean even according to this weekly time frame you can see the previous high let's only focus around the previous high this rising trend line is considered as a strong line of resistance and now if the price of bitcoin starts showing weakness gets attracted to us this horizontal trend line gets attracted to us this 0 0.5 0 0.600 fibonacci line then you can see in that case it will be just a retest again 70 72 000 will be there acting as support and price after that is expected to continue in this manner i mean i personally think the price of bitcoin has already entered this mark of face so any sort of a pullback will be just a temporary pullback to liquidate the over average longs and only after the start with an actual bullish continuation so in case of doubt i suggest you guys to simply zoom out so guys this was some of the quick update that i wanted to share with you in this video if you enjoyed my work then please do not hesitate to destroy that like button and to those individuals watching this for the first time to hit that subscribe button and also a quick reminder if you haven't claimed these free bonuses from bybit famix okx then please check the video description because these events are temporary and if you are an experienced trader who want to take advantage of this market volatility and trade with free money then definitely check the video description and by saying this i'm signing out until next time Bye bye